Hi, welcome to CC 230 Distance Adaptation. Here I am to give you a brief introduction about the course and the technologies we are going to use in this course. For this course, we will watch the pre-recorded lectures which are available on NCC hosted Panapter. The videos we are going to watch were recorded in spring 2024 semester and the instructor was Dr. David Strudwell. There is an on-campus section for this course which will be taught by TNU and we probably share the discussion forum with them. About the assessment, this course will have online quizzes, five projects, three exams and so on. Although the class lecture we will use is pre-recorded, the assessment will mostly brand new. Talking about the teaching stuff, Although we're going to use recordings from Dr. Sturgill, he won't be involved in this course. The point of contact for this course will be the administrator, which is me, and my email address is mjapari at ncsu.edu. My office hours will be on Tuesday from 2 p.m. to 4 p.m. I prefer meet by appointment if you want to meet me after office hours. We will have three teaching assistants, and I will disclose the names and the office hours on Moodle by the first week of the class. As I already said, the lectures are pre-recorded and those are already accessible on NCSO hosted PNAP2. In this course, we will have 26 lectures in total. 24 of them are already on PNAP2 and two lectures are available on YouTube. I will share the links uh, later on. The slides will be posted for the lectures on Moodle. Please follow the course schedule which can be found in the course syllabus. For the first week, we schedule two lecture videos which comes with two quizzes and those are due on the following Wednesday evening. As I already said, each lecture will be followed by a quiz which will be due on Wednesday evening of the following week. For an example, if we have three lectures scheduled on this week, the three quizzes will be due on the next Wednesday altogether. Quizzes will be proctored by the model. About the programming exercise, each lecture will be followed by at least one programming exercise, and those are due on Friday evening after the relevant lectures material is presented. For an example, if a lecture is scheduled on Thursday, exercise will be due on Friday. In this course, we will have total five projects. I would recommend to see the course syllabus for the schedule of the projects. The project one will be due on May 26th. We will use GitHub repository to submit our projects, except for the project one, where we'll submit the project on Moodle. The first project will be kind of easy, but about the rest of them, it will be somewhat difficult. And uh, I would recommend to work start working as early as possible. In this course, we will have total three exams, two midterm exams and one final. The tentative schedule for the exams are June 6 to 7 for exam 1, Ju July 8 to 9 for exam 2, and for the final exam, which is scheduled on July 29th to 30th. The midterm exams will be uh, in one hour and 15 minutes in length and uh, the final will be in for two hours and 30 minutes. All the exams will be proctored by UL. Please read them for scheduling proctors within the time window. All the exams will be closed book. I will post details on model time to time. For this course, we will use several tools for communication. For example, for discussion, we will use Piazza. For office hours, I prefer my digital hand and the Zoom. I strongly recommend to follow the model announcement and to review the course syllabus. You will get every details of the course in the syllabus. If you have any query after reviewing the syllabus, please, please reach me at my email, which is mjapari at ncsu.edu. Thank you.